Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So currently in the stable version of Mozilla Firefox, which is sitting on version 128, if you want to enable picture in picture, the pop window, as an example in YouTube, you have to click on a toggle manually to open picture in picture, which then lets you um, watch the video in a smaller kind of movable, movable window on your desktop, which you can then minimize and maximize and so on, and you get the idea. Now, in regards to picture in picture, if you are using the feature on a regular basis, you may be interested to know that in the latest Firefox 130 nightly build, uh, Pip is getting quite a nice improvement. And if we just head over to a GIF provided by the good folks over at OMG Ubuntu, yeah, we can see something interesting happening. Where uh, in the latest 130 nightly build, and the nightly builds uh, in Firefox are equivalent to Canary builds in, as an example, Chrome and Edge. So there's an option to automatically pop out the video content in picture-in-picture picture mode when you switch from the tab, the content is playing it. And this means you don't have to click the pop button on the video embedded first like I showed you. Then switch tab, you just switch tab and out it, you know, the pop window pops. So there you go. And I think that's a nice move. So basically at the end of the day, then when you go back to the original tab, the video snaps back into the player embedded on the web page and continues playing. And I actually think this is a nice move in the right direction. And thankfully, there is going to be a toggle to turn the feature off if you don't want to use it. So if you want to go back to the so-called old way of just manually clicking on a toggle without you know the pip window automatically opening, then um, there will be a toggle to uh, disable that. And Firefox 130, currently nightly, um, if this does make its way into the stable version, the stable of 130 is rolling out on the 3rd of September next month. So that's give or take in a month's time. So it'll be interesting to see if that does make it too stable. And if it does, obviously, I'll keep you guys in the loop. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.